whole setup going here. Threaded rod. Homemade faceplate. Right, tire mounted in there. Mm -hmm. Sixty RPM. Okay. Now we got, got the adjust automatic grinding jig. This rides on the center line of this axle. All right. And then we can basically follow the four inch contour with this. This is the same center line radius. Follows a four inch contour. There's a stop right here for the depth. And there's adjustment right here for the height to get it just right. First thing I'm gonna do is clean that up. different set of holes are for the different diameter tires. Those are for the smaller tire. Bolt this back on. Nice, you don't have to take all six of them off. There's a little time. And this is how they trued up balloon tires in 1894. I know that for a fact. I talked to Mr. Pennington himself and he explained it to me in a dream. Yeah. In a dream, brother. Living a dream. Get a little dusty doing this. No rubber dust never hurt anybody. All right. All right, so now we shim the perimeter. 
All right, start right here. I've got about that much of a shim last time. Go to the opposite side. Kind of balance it. Rattle it around a little. Opposite side. Basically want the outside centered as best as possible. That way the inside will fit a rim as long as the rim's concentric. And you'll have a tighten these up a little. Don't want it to form the tire. Okay. All right. Put the grinder back on. I'm gonna grind this surface right here. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. And she's turning pretty true. Nice. Ta da! That's what I'm talking about.